No, so what happened Saturday, for those of you that maybe aren't aware, uh, I, I left because of, like, severe thunderstorms. And then I was going to come back on stream, and then first time called me and said he was bringing Chinese home. So I was like, well, I'm going to wait for that. And then when I did come back, I had some internet issues, got kicked out of the server, but I was still streaming, which was weird. And then just, like, somebody hit a light switch, and boom, that there went my internet. And it was down to, like, 1, almost 2 o'clock in the morning on sun Saturday, Sunday morning, technically. And uh, so I just kind of got salty and, like, yeah, if I would have had... Uh, I didn't have any alcohol, but I was just, like, kind of, you know, annoyed. I don't know. It was a whole thing. So, Where can you find the weights? Uh, the minion weight's in the mod hub. It's in the mod downloadable content. Mod hub thing. Whatever it's called, it's there. You betcha. So... It was a whole thing Saturday, you betcha. It was a whole thing. So yeah. Mod downloadable content hub. It's so descriptive. It's just, that name just like flows right off the tongue, right? No, Chuck. Yeah, I heard I missed uh, I missed a bunch of T Rex in too. I wasn't able to watch your stream go Saturday because I sat here and I scrolled TikTok until my phone died, and then I was like, "Oh, now I don't have any internet." That's sad. It was very sad. And then I was like, "Oh, I get to sit here and listen to a cricket chirp, yay!" That was my entertainment Saturday night chat. And then I went and murdered the cricket. Very uplifting story. I took a turn. <laughs> R.I.P. that cricket. Hey. <laughs> Actually, there was like four of them, but yeah. Uh, you assumed we went out partying. You would assume wrong. We should have gone mini. Actually, you know what, Zach? You and I should go mini golfing and like film that. That would be entertaining. Let's go. Like head Portable mount GoPro stream. film it. Let's go. Let's go. Did you say head mount? Head mount GoPros. Yeah. Let's get it. I'm in. It's cool enough outside. You could actually have done that today. Not so miserable out there today, you know? How do you get controls up? For what mod or for auto drive course play? For which one? Because it's different for both. So yeah, thanks for the uh, follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? So course play is going to be either your right mouse button or delete. And thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Auto drive is going to be alt plus numpad zero. This map is not on Mod Hub. It's available through Stevie's. Uh, did he get his Facebook back? His YouTube for sure. I heard there was an issue with his Facebook. I don't know if he got it back or not. So definitely it's through available through Stevie's YouTube and it is a PC only map. So yeah. Oh, oh, oh sorry, Mickey. My apologies. Actually, uh, Ghost, going back to Saturday for first time and I going out and partying. First time went to bed at like 10 o'clock at night. So. I went in my house once and I was like, man, it's really quiet in this house. There's like no activity. Like dad was already in bed, I think. And first time was off to bed. And it was funny. As you know, there's nothing to do when the internet doesn't work. Uh, currently playing Farm Sim 17. Nice. Very nice. Stay on target. Stay on target. Oh no. Okay, apparently we're saying we're full. All right, bail trailer. I think it lies. It's like the cake. It's a lie. This isn't going bad with uh, having two mores and two bailers. I don't think anyway. 
not going too bad. Putting away the leaders, man. That's all I know. The two two bail pickers. Well, one and we'll call it a half. First plan, I'll drive her a, a half. For this job, anyway. Not the best, but it's better than not having it. Yeah, I like to look at it anyway. All right. Put it reverse there. Should have actually looked. I think we were... We were out of dry alfalfa before we started. I don't think we were out of regular... Regular alfalfa, though. So we got 846,000 off the other field of dry. That's pretty good. It's not bad at all. Next time we'll have to dry like half of this big field, maybe. I put almost done. Wait, what's your main game there, Traxxas? In eight years. Remember, this is what I do for a job, too. And I really like Farm Sim, so I play it a ton even when I'm not, like, streaming and stuff. I mean, it's all far the stream map or the, you know, whatever. I don't have a map I play just to, to play, you know? I don't have that. Oh, yeah. The Hunter Classic. All right. I didn't know that game. That's been out for eight, eight years. That's such a long time. I was like eight years younger than I am now back when that game came out. It's crazy. Amazing Can you tell us again what it was like when dirt was invented? <laughs> when dirt was invented? Yeah. Or discovered, what? I guess. <laughs> nah, it was grown in a lab. Oh. I was there. I would know. You would know. Yeah. A hey, uh, lettered. What? You know, the, the question has come up throughout the years. Uh, like, what would I do if I wasn't streaming? Yeah. Okay. I, I finally figured it out. What? I finally have a legitimate answer. I would become a professional mirror cleaner. Professional mirror cleaner? Yeah. You know why? 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 Because that's a job I could really see myself doing. Oh, hey, Leonard. How's it going? I just had a bad dream. <laughs> Don't tell me I actually got you on that one, did I? <laughs> a little bit? A little bit? So <laughs> Storms is done. He's out of here. <laughs> That's fine, Storms. All you ever do is turn off my internet anyway. Gosh. Oh, that was a good one, right? It was something. I've been holding that joke. I've been holding that joke for like a like a week. I should have kept holding yeah. that one, huh? Yeah. <laughs> How long of that did I reflect on that? A little while. I told my dad it yesterday. My dad's kind of my test audience sometimes. Before I uh, before I bring jokes to stream, you know, there's a, there's another good one too, but it's kind of. It's kind of out there, you know. Work on No Man's Land? What about No Man's Land? No way. No way. The job I could see my... Come on, that's funny. Apparently not. Okay. Hated here. <laughs> What's up, Tony? I'll, I'll give it to you. I'll Save us. Save us, Tony. So how about that weather? Uh, kind of gloomy today, but kind of nice at the same time, you know? It's not 85 degrees in here when I'm trying to stream tonight, you know? Therefore, I'm okay with it. I thought the joke was funny. That is my go-to answer from now on if anybody ever asks me what I would do if I wasn't streaming, for the record. Mm -hmm. That will be my forever answer. So, buckle up, chat. Some 
unsuspecting poor soul comes in here and asks me that. Y'all are going to know what's about to happen. <laughs> For the record, I got it from TikTok, so, you know. The joke definitely has some comedic uh, tendencies. Yeah. <laughs> Leonard, really? Come on. That was funnier than your joke. <laughs> A Zaz rap? No, the funny thing is you guys can't see that he just blocked, like, the whole the whole question about what would I do if I wasn't doing this. Like, what would I do for a job? Yeah. Should have left it on TikTok. Away, Storms. I got another one I'll tell you guys in, in uh, TeamSpeak later. Great. I, I kind of feel bad, John, because you were so excited. They're just raking you through the coals on this. <laughs> so bad. It's kind of like when I do self-deprecating humor, because there's only like, you know, it's like not, not a light to laugh at self-deprecating humor, but at the same time, like, it's hilarious how awkward it gets, and that's what makes it funny. It's it's not the, you know, oh, John's making a fat joke about himself. That part's not funny. It's the, oh, everybody just got quiet and awkward. That's what's funny. Like, when I talk about skydiving and having to get two parachutes, you know how expensive that is, chat? As Tony's over there giggling. <laughs> you know, I, I, I'll be honest. Do you guys ever see, like, the paramotor? The parasail paramotor thing where they have, like, the engine strapped to their back and the big fan? You know what I'm talking about? I'm being serious on this one. No. You don't know? You've never seen that? I'm going to... I, I kind of? Hold on. It's basically a parachute, and then you have, like, a... a four-cylinder you know, Honda strapped to your back, you know. Parasailing? Parasail or paramotor, I think they call it. You ever seen the movie Fly Away Home? <laughs> no. That's what it's about. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, your, yeah, yeah, yeah. Your sides hurt from the mirror joke. Yes, I made, I made one person laugh. Yes. It made my head hurt. <laughs> okay. So, like, I've always thought, like, that would be sick to do, okay? You know, it's just you and a parachute and a little four-cylinder, you know? But I think I'd need, like, a small small block Chevy, you know? Need a few more horsepower, you know what I'm saying? No? John, I'm sorry I laughed at the, the parachute joke. It just caught me off guard, that's all. I'm sorry. <laughs> it, I'm sorry, I feel like a bad person now. It's okay, Zach, it was meant to be funny. Oh, man. Oh, so weather, huh? It's not 90 <laughs> degrees out there. Speak for yourself. Dude, Leonard, it was like eight, mid-80s here today and kind of cloudy all day, a little, little drizzle, you know? It was like mid-80s when I woke up this morning at 5. Yeah? It was, it was, it was, it was like 78 when I woke up. Man. Not 85, but still. Wow. Yeah. Yesterday was like 94, 95. But for some reason, the parachute got you. Let's go. Uh, for some reason, it was just like really sweaty at the farm yesterday. Like dad and I were dying down there yesterday. Were you playing Fortnite or what? <laughs> See, that was funny. That was kind of That funny. was funny. <laughs> I need that cat and play your strike. Wow. I ain't. Uh, no, we were not playing Fortnite at the farm yesterday. We were working on the tractor. And, like, just very sweaty. Is that about finished? <laughs> we're getting there. The fuel okay. tank is sitting on the tractor. It's not attached in any way. But it, at least it's sitting there. We got the new shutoff sediment bowl on there. The fuel line that I bought is actually too long uh, for it and slightly the wrong shape. It's a metal fuel line, so it's not just like, oh, just bend it. No. I need a special tool. So Dad was going to look into that today at work, talk to his mechanic buddy, see if we could borrow a special tool for that. For what? For a metal fuel line. Oh. You don't just want to, like, bend it because you'll crimp it. So you got to have, like, the little bender tool, you know? And I just, I don't have one. 
Or so. you could get like a piece of wire that's just smaller than the tube and put it in there and then bend it. And that would probably work well, yeah. I never thought about that, but yeah, you're right. That would work. Uh, but anyway, so that needs to be... Oh, okay. So that <laughs> needs to happen. That's one way to get it. <laughs> that's one way to get that bail. It does not have flare deads, Jacob. No. No, no flare deads. So it's actually, it's kind of weird. It's too long, but like not just on one end. Like both ends need to be trimmed just the way it's bent. And then this needs to be tweaked a little bit with a bend it just a little bit more. Um, but at least the fuel tank is on the tractor. It's sitting on the tractor for the first time since like we got the thing to the farm. So it was kind of exciting. And the grill is sitting on the tractor. So it kind of looks like a tractor right now. So, I mean, we're, we're making big moves, you know? Big money moves, huh? Because you know last time you were there, it didn't really look like a tractor. Yeah. Since it was still in two pieces. Are we mowing uh, four through seven right now? E That's fine, yeah. Uh, Ted or no Ted? Uh, we will... Uh, no Ted that one. Well, Ted 13. At least this time. Next time we might flip flop them and Ted the big field and not Ted the small field to kind of even our even out, you know. I'm trying to think what it looked like last time I was there. Uh, it was in two pieces still. Remember, the like whole rear end and stuff was rolled to the right. Remember, not really ringing a bell. You could see inside of the transmission. Or wait, have you even been down there that recently? You might have been down there before we even took the transmission apart. It's I feel like it's been a while since you've been down there, right? <laughs> the last time I was down there was on a Sunday. <laughs> Thank you, Captain Obvious. Come on, that was funny. Hey! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Your reaction was great. I clipped it, don't worry. Last time I was down there was on a Sunday. Really, Zach? <laughs> oh my goodness, Tony. Trent, where are you going? Rung the bell out. What? No. Jacob, are you <laughs> good? Yeah, I don't know what he's on about. Tomcat, thanks for the bits. But, uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, so no, it's back in one piece now. And like I said, the fuel tank's sitting on there. The radiator or the grill is sitting on there. Um, the next step is get the fuel tank actually like attached and plumbed in. And then where's my auto drive guy? Is he, you know, he's stuck in the homestead. How long has he been stuck in the homestead for? I wonder. I don't know. I bet he hasn't even taken one load of bales in. He's been stuck on these pallets. I put him there. It's my fault. Um... I found your auto drive guy. What do you mean? Oh, I, okay. He asked where he was. He's, he's there. All right, Mickey, we'll catch you. I realize now what you're talking about. That was funny, too. <laughs> Not as good as the mirror joke. Drink some uh, rotten milk on accident the other day. That was better than the mirror joke. <laughs> Did it have pulp right. in it? Uh, some milk pulp? Oh, yeah. Extra, extra pulpy milk? Yep. That just makes me uncomfortable, honestly. Like, it doesn't gross me out. I just, uncom I'm uncomfortable when that topic comes up. Milk pulp? Yeah. I don't know better. why. Better than a uh, crunchy mashed potatoes. You mean cat hair infused mashed potatoes? Crunchy, yeah. Crunchy. Oh. Everything's funky. All right. All right. But yeah, it's uh, it's a, it's a whole thing, man. But yeah, so it's it's really it's really coming together. You know, we actually have oil in the in the rear end slash transmission slash like PTO. It's all one chamber kind of. That was that was good. Eight quarts of oil. 
which will have to get changed before Pinkneyville sometime. What kind of oil does it take? Uh, it's, it calls for 20 weight, but we went ahead and just put some good old standard uh, 30 weight in there. Uh, we just figure, you know, it's fine. So, 30 weight oil is kind of cheap, you know, so it's it's fine. Uh, but the the theory of the tractor is to try to get the thing together. Try to get the thing outside. Well, we need new tires on there too, but um, but try to get it out, drive it around, you know, kind of break it in a little bit, maybe do a little plowing with it, then change all the fluids. We want to change antifreeze, everything. So, Dave, we'll catch you later. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. I found uh, on the lake. But yeah, that's the theory is, you know, get it nice and hot a couple times, you know, kind of break everything in and then change all the fluids and hopefully get it nice and set for Pinkneyville so we can just roll off the trailer and go plow. Uh, thanks for the uh, follow. Welcome in. How's it going? I have a feeling, though, here soon, like we're going to have to start going down there like Tuesdays and Thursday nights after stream or something. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, I mean, we just... Even if we go down and just work on it for, you know, half an hour, that's half an hour more than we working on it before, you know? Oh, yeah, so. just to get it ready for the... Yeah, because, uh, what do we have? 20 days? So, yeah. Don't know if Dad's ordered the uh, rear tires yet. I know he has the fronts. Don't know if he has the rears. I have to ask him about that. Because definitely the one tire's junk on the back. The, both fronts are just destroyed. This deer has good brakes, Chuck says. What, did you almost run into something, Chuck? Could be a problem. My deer doesn't have good brakes. I, I only know how to hit the accelerator, so. You betcha. You betcha. Oh, oh, yeah, I did. You're right, Chuck. It was me. Sorry, I was thinking about my future career. Joke chat. Joke. Some of you probably don't wish it was a joke at this point. Just go away. It happens. Definitely happens. Yeah, see, I've been driving through that field the whole time, and I kind of forget that you guys are in that field now, so. Yeah. What you see is what you get, right? Uh, that's do you guys... Songs. Go on, Tony. I said, I think that's one of your songs. Oh, okay. Uh, do you guys need end rows cleaned up? Uh, we just started. We just finished the end rows. I don't know yet. Like, bail wise You probably do. I'll be over there in a second. I mean, whenever you get to it. We're that's basically fine. chasing Ch Chuck down. That's fine. I'll uh, let Auto Drive finish this field. I'll come over and help you guys. Alright. So I don't... I don't farm in real life. Uh, the place I'm talking about where my tractor's at and stuff, I call the farm. It is the farm my dad grew up on. We still own like five acres of it. Uh, unfortunately, the rest got sold after my grandpa passed away. So I don't farm in real life. I do grow about an acre of pumpkins every year. So I don't know if you want to call me a farmer because of that. I garden, we'll say. Uh, but last year I had the opportunity to buy an Alice Chalmer uh, Model B. And that's the tractor I keep talking about. It has kind of become my life. So, yeah, it was locked up for probably six years, I think. Six or seven years it was locked up for. Uh, Dad talked to the, the previous owner the other day, and uh, he, he said something. It's been at least six years is what the guy is, something like that. So, 
it's been locked up for a while and dad and i are uh i wouldn't say restoring the tractor i would say we're fixing it fixing it up and making it functional is basically what we're doing we're not painting uh our thing is just make it sound mechanical and like if it has you know it has a big dent in the hood a tree fell on it you know once upon a time but it has character you know so that's that's what we're doing refurbishing kind of i guess yeah midwest uh, i'm out in st louis i'm here in st louis Jason, it is a uh, 1947 Alice Chalmer Model B, as in boy. B-boy. And then last year, a couple of my siblings and I got together and we bought Dad a C, Alice Chalmer C. And then I actually had another opportunity to pick up a tractor for the low, low price of trading two cases of beer. And that's an Alice Chalmer C-A. So welcome in from Illinois. Howdy neighbor. <laughs> Woody, no, we're not doing the 100,000 bale challenge again. Absolutely not. We are making a lot of bales tonight, but not, not going for the 100,000 again. No way. No way. I don't think anybody would want to do that again. Just saying. Maybe Chuck. I know Chuck liked it, but yeah, that was a uh, that was a whole thing, y'all. Okay, maybe not Chuck. <laughs> maybe not Chuck. Grass and a money maker when you first start. Gotcha. Gotcha. Oh, you would, Chuck. Okay. Well, I'm not doing it, Chuck. So you're off the hook, at least. Yeah, over here. Baylor's nearing a thousand. Is it really already? Wow. Pretty good. That is pretty good. All right. So at least with auto drive running the other field there, it'll finish that field up for us. We don't have to worry about that. Just kind of nice. And then I can keep the bales out of the way of the moors uh, over in this field with kind of focusing over here uh, a little bit. There is only one baler running, so I may jump into that here in a minute just to kind of help keep the rodeo going. But we'll see. You never know. Rats. So yeah, we have a 47, a 49, dad's tractor is from 49, and a 53 is the CA. So those are the years of the... Uh, Alice Chalmers tractors that found their way to the farm last year in three months. We got a tractor a month for three months in a row. So that was kind of fun. Kind of fun. When is the festival? That would be August 19th is the day that we're going, Justin. August 19th. Pinkneyville, Illinois. Look it up if you want. It's a ton of fun. If you're into like, you know, seeing old tractors and stuff. I think it's a ton of fun personally. Zach, you like it, right? I do. I just, I think what's really fun is just, it's so laid back. You know, it, it's not a stressful environment. Everybody's just kind of chilling, doing their own thing, but like, some random person would also stop and talk to you for an hour if you wanted to. Sounds like a town from The Simpsons. Kind of, Chuck. Kind of. 
Then the uh, farm prior show that coming up soon. Yep. Yep. Won't be going to that one. Pony, are you gonna come over for that one? Yo. Why can't we bail this over here? Tramp. I I thought we could, so that's why I, I mowed it. I'll have to rake it in. I'd have to make that trip. Uh, Justin, the one that's close to you will be next year. That's an every other year show. So is he in Iowa? 1979 John Deere 950. Very nice, Jason. That's awesome, man. Now, Chuck, it makes sense. I just, I wasn't sure what was going on there, you know? Uh, Justin, I will say, if you're going to go to a farm show, uh, Tony posted the link there for it. I would definitely, definitely, definitely consider uh, renting a golf cart. They have golf carts that you can rent for the day. They're, I think, right around-ish, 100 bucks a day. But it, it makes it so much better. Yeah. The dead spots on this map are so frustrating. They are kind of weird, right? We can let that go through. I know that Automod hates that term. But it's fine. I got you, Justin. That's cool. Runs great, but two gears are shot. That's unfortunate. Very unfortunate. But yeah, so the, the Pinkneyville Farm Show. I don't know how big the, the grounds are that the show is actually on. But it's like... It's fair size. I mean, it's... Zach, what do you think? 10 acres or more oh it's i know the the other show that justin's talking about that's closer to him that was 100 acres last year the farm progress show the uh, renter one. Oh, that's 100 acres at least it was last year they said this year or next year it's going to be bigger so that show you definitely need a side by side or something for it is crazy big because mostly that show that's closer to Justin there, that is mostly field demos. As opposed to Pink Meville, which is partial field demo, but also just a lot of tractors sitting around in rows that you can look at too. Plus like the old hit and miss engines and stuff with horses and, you know, all the, all the steam stuff, you know. Lots of steam at that show. Plus the old like threshing machines and old balers and all the all that stuff. You have a side by side by then for sure. Nice. Yeah, it's you definitely need something. Uh, otherwise, you would because the problem is most of these shows are in the summer. Most of these shows that I'm talking about are in August, so it's always hot. So if it's really really hot and then you have to go walk around a hundred acres. That's going to be miserable. So I, I'm i not about that personally. Just, a, just saying. No, thank you. All right. Just going to let that sit. We're going to make some bales, chat. Make some bales. And especially at the renter show because, you know, they go out there with those plows and they'll plow these huge areas you can't walk in that after they plow it i mean you can but it's like walking on sand at a beach you know it's, it's miserable so in 100 degree heat in the sunshine and it's super dusty it's kind of miserable but kind of fun at the same time just uh throwing it out there the best part of that show was dad and i had our side by side from the farm and we just threw the cooler in the back. So we always had ice cold drinks with us. So we didn't have to go like up to the main farm to like buy something cold. We could just be out back on the back hundred acres, you know, and having our cold drinks. It was, it was kind of nice. Just uh, throwing it out there. You guys having fun moments still? 
Oh yeah. Just back and forth. You staying inside the lines this time? Kinda. Of. Kinda. Of. <laughs> huh? I can tell. Yeah, because both of us <laughs> are on Facebook. <laughs> Trying to is the farm progress here pretty neat? It's it's not too bad. You can talk to a lot of people. Is farm progress more new stuff or is that old stuff? It's a lot of new stuff. Okay. So I always thought. Isn't it basically like the show on Kentucky just outside but with a bunch of demos? Uh, there's a field across the road that that's where they do all the field demos. Yeah. Or I guess it's not like the Kentucky show, but No. Hey Lug Bug, uh, I hope you're doing all right, man. That's crazy. Holy do God. a lot of walking. Unless you bring your own side by side or golf cart. I'm sure they have a rental company there too. Uh, I don't know. You'd There's probably have to book that like months ago at this point. Those, yeah, okay. So farm, oh, sorry. Uh, farm progress. Does it, it has old stuff and new stuff? Is that what it is? I've never been. I don't know. I've never really watched any videos from there. Uh Sometimes some vendors will have it because, like, one year Case had their like Case IH steam engine there. Okay. So it depends on the vendor. Track tractors, uh, it in game yeah, it doesn't matter. They're all the same. Yeah. <laughs> Making sure you uh, turned around in time. Yeah, in game a tractor is a tractor. There's no difference between tractor. It's just they look cool. That's all. And this is way too big of a tractor to run a baler, but like that's fine. No. <laughs> Overkill is underrated. There's something, right? You gotta pull the hills. They're not even that big on this map. I mean, over there to our right, but like that's it. Oh, power! You need all the power, chat. Really, it really ain't that bad. From just Hills. to Decatur, it's a little over two hours. Oh, Pinkneyville is only uh, an hour and a half, so it's not much farther than they're going to Pinkneyville. Just kind of going it's the about other like direction. An hour, hour and a half for me. Yeah, to Tony. Go to Decatur. Tony, yeah. you, me, we'll get Dad's trailer on Eddie with the side by side. Let's go to the Farm Burger Show. Oh, I'm in. <laughs> I am in. <laughs> Yeah, I am too. I wonder if I can. That is true, Plugger. Good point. No such thing as overkill. You're right. Sycamore. I think it's like maybe 10 or 15 bucks to get in. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm sure you, at most of these shows, you have to like pay to get in, and then you have to pay for your like side by side too. We still have the tag on our show from that August we went to last August. It's still on the handle of the side by side for some reason. We haven't taken it off yet. It's still there. A year later, almost a year. Whatever. It's I don't think I've taken my side by side to the uh, Farm Progress show. Yeah. When is Farm Progress? The week like after the twenty twenty ninth through the thirty first. Oh, so it's after Pink Mayville. So, right. so Zach, our job is to convince Dad to let us take his trailer and his side by side to farm progress. Oh, why don't he just see if he can take off work? He'd want to go yeah. too, yeah. Where are we putting you in the back of the side by side? It starts. I, yeah, I'll sit on top of the cooler. I'm chilling. <laughs> it starts the uh, the 29th of August. I got gotcha. you. That's weird. It's not like on a weekend. Yeah. You no, know, that's that's the way some of those like industry shows are though. They're just during the week because people use it as a work trip. That'd be cool though. That would be funny to go over there. Two farm shows in a month. Let's get it. I'm, I'm here. <laughs> I'm here for it. Oh man, I don't know if Pops would let us do that, but you know why not ask? Right? Never hurts to ask. Or something, yeah. right? That'd be something. That'd be crazy. That's a big show. It's like a lot of acres, isn't it? Pretty sure. Pretty sure. 
But yeah, Pink Meeville's all old stuff. So if you like old stuff, though, that's that's the show. As far as I'm concerned. I've been to one other show kind of local over here. It's it's a real small show. We were talking about going to a show up in, like, northern Missouri. Or, like, an hour and a half or two hours north. Uh, but they don't even have a website. <laughs> So we know like nothing about the show, so we're just like, nah, maybe we don't go to that one. If we can't even get like, hey, what time do they open? What time do they close? Like anything? So we just not gonna do that. Plus my aunt and uncle always go to uh, Pink Meville because my uncle used to be real big in like the horse world with like the draft horses and stuff. He, he doesn't have a team anymore because he's, you know, uh, getting up there in years and he sold his team off but uh he still knows all the guys so he'll probably end up my uncle will probably end up with some help from some younger guys to get, get him up on a uh old wagon they pull around with a couple horses and he'll probably end up just driving around a whole bunch of the at least in the morning while they still have the horses out before it gets too hot usually they get a couple of the old guys up there and let them let them drive a team around in, in a wagon and they give rides to people so, I bet, I bet he's got some stories about like back in the day, like working on these horses and stuff. Oh yeah, yeah. If you can get my uncle to talk, yes, <laughs> he's got stories. <laughs> and if you can understand him, he's got stories. Uh, you know the old joke about like, uh, if you have one brother that talks normal and the other brother that talks kind of like he's from the south, you know, it's because that brother. Grew up, grew up on the southern end of the house, you know. Well, my my uncle must have grown up like around the corner, down the block from where Dad grew up, because like Dad doesn't talk really southern like at all. And man, my uncle, holy cow! Man, he's hard to understand. He called me one time because I sent him some pictures of a project we were working on, and he called me, and like, it's the first time I think I'd ever talked to him on the phone. This is last year. And I was out mowing grass and I'm like fumbling with my phone, but I ended up, ended up answering the call and like, he didn't even have to say who it was. I knew who it was hundred percent just because of the way he talks. And, uh, I think I understood about three words in that 20 minute phone call, but I just like nodded, which he couldn't hear, but I was like, uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. He, uh, he, he definitely grew up on the Southern end of the house. We'll say. Yeah, kind of funny, but super nice guy, of course. Just yeah, can't understand. You've met him before, Zach, right? Yeah, I think so. Think maybe. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I've met him. I, I don't. Yeah. I never like sat down and had a conversation with him. You should try to this year, and then just we'll debrief and be like, how much of that did you understand? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll let's do it. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't mind get to know. Him. I'll get to know him if I keep seeing him like once a year. Might as well, you know. <laughs> Oh, and I don't think my cousin will be there this year. Gotcha. I think uh, she's off to college, so I doubt she'll be there. So, yeah, kind of a thing. Anyway, I should probably... Wait. Mickey must be back. The bail trailer's moving over there. Wait a minute. What's going on here? That guy's still... Cleaning up bales in the other field, huh? Does he actually have bales on his trailer right now, guys? Can you guys see uh, him? He just got here. Okay. Is he driving to the out in the field, or is he stopped? Uh, he's moving currently. Okay, so there's still bales. The French rednecks in Louisiana. That's what he tracks us. Now we talk about like, you know, north of the Missouri River, it's Missouri, and then south it's Missouri. He's definitely Missouri. Okay. I did it again. <laughs> what do you like Britney Spears over there? You'll see. Oops, Tony did it again. I mean, come on, Tony. I, I'm trying to get tickets for the prop farm progress show and I still was able to turn around. I just really need to get like off my phone or like not tabbed out or 
Trent's over here buying tickets to the farm show, huh? Buy tickets. Yeah, I'm still paying attention to a lot. How much are tickets? Single ticket. What do we got? Uh, you guys are 15 bucks. So if I buy a ticket, I have to go, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's what you should do, John. You should be like, I bought a ticket. I bought you a ticket. I day. I gotta, gotta go. go. Gotta go. You could win a Yeti tailgate prize pack. Prize value is at eleven hundred dollars. What? You could you could enter to win. Oh. I should talk to Dad about farm progress. That'd be kind of cool. It's up over there. One thousand one hundred and ten dollar value. Wow. Side day or single. The problem is if we just have a side by side, that's like that's only good for two of us. You know what I mean? We can get you a bucket, Zach, and like a cushion. Well, you're gonna you're gonna sit well, on. You're gonna bring a cooler. Tony can just ride in the middle. Yeah, but uh, no, no, there's no room in the middle. I'll just I'll ride on the cooler. I tell you, do you do you have like a dump bed or something? My car my car's small enough. I can try it down the lanes. Interesting, Sean. Don, what's up? How's it going? Uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. How's it going? You're just gonna drive Eddie through the. The show. Yeah, I'll, I'll have air conditioning. Just get you like a vanity license plate that says golf cart, <laughs> and then like you're fine. Just take your plates off when you get there. I tell you, I'll throw an orange triangle on the back. That would <laughs> be a <problem. laughs> slow moving vehicle. I don't see what could go wrong here. I, I don't at all. Oh, I got it. Five head. I'll run with Trent. Five head. Bring a little lawnmower trailer. I don't. Oh, Tony, we could get one of the, uh, like, the little carts. <laughs> we can break out one of the pumpkin day wagons for you, Tony. How much is, I'm, I looked this up. I'm going to rent a side, rent a side by side. Do they have side by side you could rent? I just Googled it. I don't know. Oh, what, why don't you, they should have, like, a golf cart rental thing at the show. That's and honestly, bad. I'd rather do that than drag a trailer. How far is it? Two hours away? Like, I'd rather just rent a something there, you know? That's why we do it at Pinkneyville. It's an hour and a half away. I'd rather just rent. Uh, yeah. Please note, golf carts are sold out Tuesday and Wednesday. Two passenger golf carts are still available for Thursday. Oh, looks like we're going Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> so you're saying there's a chance. Yeah, yeah saying that you basically got to purchase the uh, permit if you're going to bring your own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Tony, you got to come to the farm Wednesday. We got to convince Dad we're going. I don't know why he needs to be involved, but I think he'd, he would enjoy it. Okay. All right, let's do it. Oh, and uh, no pull-behind attachments to golf carts are permitted. Oh, sad. Good good thing we're going to have a side-by-side, -side, not a golf cart. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best part of a farm show, seeing all these like crazy rigs that people rig up to go behind their side by sides or golf carts or tractors to like move people. You know, they'll be they'll be over at Pinkmeville, they'll be like trailers with like full on seats out of like Astro vans or whatever from back in the day. You know, all these like seats and stuff. And I don't, I don't uh think farm progress is about that life, John. No, farm progress is it, it sounds different. Anybody else lagging in here, or is it just me? Yeah, uh, it's definitely me. I'm okay. feeling it too. A little jumpy right now, right? Uh huh. All right. Good. I'm glad it's not just me. Everybody's feeling it. Okay. Good. 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 Need one of those cooler scooters. I don't know if they I, do. They have pavement at this Farm Progress show. I, I doubt it, right? Oh yeah. They, they have, have pavement. pavement? Uh huh. They're getting fancy now, huh? Getting real fancy. Now, I don't know if I can park. attend this. This sounds too like proper for me. Now where you park, you better hope it didn't rain the day before. Well, yeah. It's most farm shows. So Trent, if I drink a bush light, am I gonna fit in or what? Yeah, they do serve beer, so. You should have started with that. I mean, uh, let's see. Is this okay? So this field is done. Uh, over yonder. So I'm gonna start picking bales up over there to try to help with like, boy, something's oh off auto drive, buddy. Something's bad all of a sudden. 
Let's try it. A cooler scooter. God, those local baseball games we used to go to, they would have one of those cooler scooters for their mascot to ride around on. And in the cooler, he would keep things like, you know, cans of shaving cream or silly string or stuff like that to mess with people in the crowd. It was really funny. Especially this one night. He completely, like, covered this dude in shaving cream. I'm assuming he was, like, buddies with him. Like, IRL. But, I don't know. I'm not sure. Bear, what's up? I don't know whether we're friends in IRL or not. You, you, know, you cover me in shaving cream, we're going to have a problem. But what if I'm a mascot at a sporting event? Oh, that, that forgets everything. Yeah, that's what it was. It was a mascot. Oh. So it's fine, right? Yeah, those mascots get away with a lot more uh, than they should. Right? Like the huge bag of popcorn they cover people, and it's like, dude, that's probably greasy. Yeah, yeah or, or, you know, cotton candy getting thrown to people. Yeah. Or, yeah. This is so laggy right now. It's probably the mowing. I had to guess. Actually, more stop for a minute. Just just where you are, just stop moving real quick. Let's test it. Because usually the, the laggy part is mowing. We know this from bailing 100,000 bales after all. You guys stop. I yeah. did. All right, cool. It's not the mowing. Never mind. Probably the thousands <laughs> of bales that we have on the ground. Not that many. There's only all of these. I don't know how many there are. It's bad, though. And whatever your guy's still picking up in the other field? No, that field's done. I stole that guy. I'm in that guy. I have that. No, it's not too many mods. It's it's the bales. It's not the mods. We don't have that many. Paul Rubens. Yes, Sean, I saw that. Don't worry. I'm gonna I'm gonna mighty mouse this situation. Are you? Yep. Okay. What's that mean? So you're the reason why we're lagging. Here I come to save the day. Oh, mighty mouse. Is the way that one. Okay. Yep. I, I am old. Saying, I do know that. You know. Yeah. 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 Man, this map's laggy. It's bad right now, isn't it? Oh, what happened to the other uh, trailer? Which one? The other bale trailer. It's Mickey, I believe, is in one. Go ahead, pick up a third. Okay. I, it, it won't hurt to have another one, trust me. So. Yeah, I believe Mickey's in one. I've got one. And then, uh. I did not realize that you guys had both of them going already. I had one on auto drive, slash course play in the other field for, like, a lot of it. Hey, Tony, I'm going to start doing these uh, small rows over here. 10 4 there, Trent. 10 4. Oh, you're, uh, you're bringing out your trucker talk. Back with, yeah. Hey, you know, Oklahoma's tomorrow. I'm not playing oh. it, but it's tomorrow. Well, I forgot that comes out tomorrow. Right? I'm not to... playing that either. I've been having issues. Plus Although, shifter. you know, it's a lot cooler now. I could maybe play it. Are, I don't know. Are you still having problems with it? Who? You, with like your setup, or you just Dude, can't stream I, from that? I, I, I can stream, I just can't use my webcam, and everybody wants to see my beautiful face, so. Bear, did you hear my joke earlier? Uh, no, I didn't. Don't, you don't want to hear it, Bear. You don't want to hear I don't know. It. I, I don't know. It sounds like I want to hear it. You want to hear a, bear, a, a joke, Bear? Sure. Get, re get ready to leave. <clears throat> so you know how sometimes people will come in chat and they'll be like, Hey, if you weren't a streamer or content creator, what would you do? Right? Okay. Okay, so I, I finally figured out my, like, honest Dave. Dave, you said you were lurking. <laughs> oh, this is so leggy. Uh, so I finally figured out my, like, my answer bear. Okay. Okay, that is, I want to be a professional mirror cleaner. Okay. I'm sorry, do you spell that M-I-R-R-O-R or M-E-E-R? Yes. A mirror okay. cleaner, like, you a know, mirror cleaner. mirrors, you know, yeah. like a mirror. Okay. Mirror. Mirror. And, uh, because that's a job I could really see myself doing. Yeah. Yep. 
Mm -hmm. It was that bad head to come out of lurk. Sorry, Dave. Oh, this okay. map is really laggy. It was better the first time. Leonard left team speak. The first Anybody time. else hear the crickets? He, he, he straight offended them. <laughs> he straight up left. Wait, is there more crickets? Do I need to go murder him? Yeah, I think oh, I just chilling. already heard him. We're chilling. I, I checked. No, I think they're back because you said that joke. No, 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 no. They're all dead. I killed them all. This is so bad right now, guys. Oh my uh, goodness. Uh-huh. The crickets are all dead. Yeah. Oh my god, this is laggy right now. Wow. Uh I mean this isn't hundreds. the local this isn't local for you, no, right? This, this, this is this is this is the server. Yeah. yeah. Uh we still do use TeamSpeak, yes. I know we're the old people of the internet that use TeamSpeak. I know nobody else does, but... You know whatever. what? It works. Does Thank it, though? <laughs> Thank yeah, you, Chuck. Though, Bear? I've never had a problem with it. You guys want to stop mowing, too? Chuck has stopped bailing. You guys want to stop mowing? Just let us try to get these bales off this field. Yeah, I stopped. I was just saying, with, like, the recent, like, audio problems, that was all there. We have had some decent... Decent? Uh, we have had some recent uh, audio issues with uh, TeamSpeak. Squeaking really weird. You're 49 and just stopped. All right, we have plenty of time then before we have to stop using TeamSpeak. Speak <laughs> uh, <Make> for yourself. <laughs> I have plenty of time. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, we have been having some issues with audio lately, but even though they're annoying, it's I still prefer it. So we have a Discord, exclamation point Discord in the chat, but we don't use it for uh, comms. We use it as like a message board. Sometimes people will stream games in there, like when I'm not live. Uh, stuff like that. But we don't use it for just sitting and talking. But like I said, we do have one. Everybody's welcome to join it. Exclamation point Discord in the chat. I had to get the uh, wireframe off the trailer. Uh, that should go oh, away when floor. you unload the first load. Okay. Right. That's your, like your, where you tip. Yeah. Okay. There. I think it just got better with that last load. It's still bad, but it's better. Okay, maybe I spoke too early. I don't know. So, uh, server PC, right, guys? Yeah. Needs to happen soon, don't Yeah. It? Yeah, what's the holdup? <clears throat> um, <clears throat> what's the holdup? I've kind of been telling myself that I would need my account to get to a certain number before I start buying stuff, but, uh, trying to have a little discipline with my finances, you know? Oh, yeah, you should have been here uh, I, today for I wish I was, off. Trent. I didn't have internet. Yeah, your phone. <laughs> yeah, that I killed watching TikTok. That's your fault. <laughs> Priorities, that Trent. Like, that sounds like a personal problem. Nope. 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 I definitely killed it watching TikTok, though. That, that is for sure. And then I was sad because I had no more internet. Yeah, we taught we taught Tony a lot of, of really good lessons I, on Saturday. I wish I was here. I do. Yeah. Might have to get like the uh, the Cliff Notes, you know. Who's Cliff? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'll tell you <laughs> off stream. I'm kidding. Uh thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? No, I have a story about somebody named Cliff. What are you talking about Cliff from Cheers? Cliff Huxtable? Like who are you talking about? Uh just just Cliff. Oh, okay. Yeah actually a great story like it's kind of messed up and kind of sad but like it's a great story that was the guy who you cheated off of in high school that's why you call him the cliff notes that's no funny. no 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 i'm not gonna get into the story but it's i'll tell you off stream okay it's a it's a w story but kind of not at the same time like it's it's wild absolutely wild but definitely not a uh, on-stream topic. 
Definitely not. Okay, so we almost got all the bales cleaned up and it's still this bad? Oh boy. Oh boy. You know, I blame Tony. <clears throat> you know what? Ew. Good call. So it's, bare. It's probably those extra windrows that he made up out of the fields, you know? That, yeah. 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 So, Tony. So, remember remember that Saturday night where you were giving all this advice? No. You never told me not to do one thing, and I kind of want to do it now. Oh, Lord. How do, you, how do you feel about tractors? <laughs> Tony, don't do it. It's a trap. Especially Sorry. ones with very nice chrome uh, exhaust. I would, I would not, <laughs> I would not advise it. Um, on re for just on return on investment. It's a trap. Yeah, for return, on, it, don't do it. What about like smiles on return? <laughs> smiles those, those, are, those are nice. Those are nice to have. Yeah, not everybody can be a baller. And, you know, buy a bunch of antique tractors and fix them up, you know. What if it cost you two cases of beer? I mean, I would have done the same thing. You don't want to know what this thing's going to cost to bring back, though. Uh, I'm, look, I'm looking at, like, people pulling tractors, and I kind of want to buy a tractor and go tractor pulling. Oh, tractor pulling? Hey. Oh, oh you, man. You, oh, yeah. man. Yeah, you, you, I thought you said you didn't want a mortgage. Add a couple more thousand, buddy, you know? Would I be cheaper buying a boat? I mean... Probably. I mean... Yeah. Uh, restart server it probably should be, but we're not gonna... Well, we might have to. I was looking at the clock going, how much time we got left? We're here till at least 10 o'clock. Um, we might have to restart the server, yeah. We'll see. Let's get all the bales cleaned up. We'll see how bad it is then. Uh, usually if a person has high ping, it usually just affects them, not everybody. So. You will have so much fun pulling tractors. Yeah, Plugger was a tractor pull guy for a long time. Oh, hey, uh, quite a nice hey, tractor. Hey, Trent, what you don't know is you can buy a tractor for two cases of beer. And from what I know, John pulls his around all over the place because it doesn't run. Exactly. <laughs> Big facts. Actually, we just pulled it off the trailer and then pulled it to a shed, and it hasn't moved since. But there big, you go. big facts, yeah. Yeah, uh, someday we're we'll having a uh, we're having a big tractor pull event out here by me here soon. Oh yeah, yeah. Nice. Uh, okay, it's still bad. All the bales are cleaned up, right? That's kind of awful. I'm about to steal some from Chuck. See what see if that works. <laughs> and we can restart. Tony, yeah. We could uh, we could just send a shut mowing since we're about done. That is very true, Jacob. Basically, take the money you would spend on that Zach, light it on fire. If you're comfortable doing that, then sure, go buy it. But if you're not, then uh, you know maybe don't. But you know, at the end of the day, here's my point. Tony, if you want to go buy a pulling tractor and you can do that, you that's what you want to do with your money. Godspeed. More power to you, bro. You know? Mm -hmm. It's your money. Ow. Do what you want with it at the end of the Can't day. Can't take it with you. Well, but it's you. but it's yours. It's not somebody else's money to tell you what to do with. Guess I can't pull a gooseneck with a explorer, though, so I gotta buy a truck. I've seen a gooseneck on a Ford Ranger before, so I mean, come on. <laughs> I'll buy a Ford Ranger! There was that one with duels, you know? Oh, man, I probably shouldn't. I don't, I don't know. I don't think I want one with, like, you gotta wear, like, the flame suit. Just give me, like, you know... <laughs> A 1066 and call of the day. But you, you know, know, I know, yeah. I know near me they have antique bolts. Yeah. yeah. As well. Yeah. Yeah, that's that'll be a thing. We usually don't stay for that at that farm show, but some year I'd like to. Like actually hang out in the grandstands and like you know have a couple beverages. Yeah. A little bag of popcorn or kettle corn. Yeah. All right, we're yeah. gonna we're gonna restart. Okay. It's bad. I'm I'm not about this life right now. Chat, stand by. We're not going anywhere. We're just gonna restart the server real fast. Um, once I exit the game, I can load the website up here. But uh, yeah, we're gonna restart. It is lagging way too much doing this bailing. I'm out. I don't matter if you're out or not. It'll kick you out. I know. <laughs> 
I saved it when I left. It don't matter after that. Is it bad that I, I left quickly so I didn't have to get kicked out? Because my right. My you, poor sensibilities couldn't take it. You don't like being, being kicked. kicked. Huh? Yeah, I don't like being booted. Noted. Ban you know, or wait, not ban. No. Kick. Would it revert, Tim? <laughs> Tomcat, thanks for the bits. Put it reverse tear. That screen in front of me is very bright, by the way. Fairy Games is the white website. Very bright. That's okay. Hey, Carson sent me something on TikTok. I have emails turned off from TikTok, but Carson sends me stuff and I get an email every single time. It's kind of annoying, but that's all right. It's all good. Put it reverse tear. Domcat, appreciate the bits, bro. Appreciate them. Actually, Zach, I mean, you might know this, but Dad's uh, Alice uh, C. Uh huh. That guy had it set up for a pulling tractor before we got it. He had only pulled with it like twice. <laughs> Didn't have enough power for him, so that's why <laughs> he a, wanted to get rid of it's it. It's a sweet looking tractor. It sounds sick. I know. I can't wait. For mine with the actual exhaust on it. It's going to sound so good. At least I hope. That's the hope anyway. We'll see. I, I ordered that for my birthday present to myself, by the way, chat. I ordered exhaust for my tractor. And dad grumbled about it. Because he's like, just get a piece of exhaust pipe. And boom, straight pipe. And I'm like, but that's not the same. <laughs> not what I want. So, um, I don't know if this, this is going to restart or are we just going to sit here and think about it all night chat. We may have just bricked the server. Rut row reggie. So chat, how's the weather? Reggy. <laughs> Opal is good. No more 80 mile per hour thunderstorm warnings, you know? I, you know what? It was weird the other night. You had your all your thunderstorms coming through. Yeah. Right? And about two hours later, uh -huh. Uh -huh. and <clears throat> I mean you kind of know the area that I live in. In a house. I had yeah. I had a huge thunderstorm warning. Set same thing. Really? It's like a it was copy pasta for the <laughs> weather center. It was seventy mile an hour winds, yep. one inch hail. I mean it was it was pretty nasty for a little while. On. Nice, Sean. When was the last backup? Uh, probably earlier today. I had to guess. But I don't know. Yeah, I'm on. It says that it restarted, but, uh, you know. I don't see the server yet, so. Who's modding? Is it Sean in here today? Uh, Sean, could you switch over to just chatting, please? <laughs> No, had a really bad one Saturday. Yeah, we did uh, here in St. Louis, too. You betcha. The funny thing, and sometimes local, like, meteorologists, you know, local TV, like, meteorologists, they don't know what they're talking about half the time, I feel like. Because the, the one guy here on our NBC station, he's, like, talking about the storm. And he starts to mention the word derecho and he's like, well, I'm not saying it's a derecho, but like it could be, this thing's been doing damage. And he basically drew a line across the St. Louis, like Metro area. And he measured that. And he's like, this storm has been producing damage for 150 miles across St. Louis. And I, and I'm like, bro, this storm started in Nebraska. The, the, that storm on Saturday, it started in Nebraska. It caused a whole bunch of damage in Nebraska and northern Missouri and all across central northern Missouri, all the way through St. Louis, across southern Illinois. Like, this storm did more damage than just here in St. Louis. And he's just like, I, I, do they not look at the radar? I don't, I don't know. I thought it was kind of funny. Snipe for Kilo 011 just subscribed. I thought it was amusing. Snipe, thanks for the, uh, uh, sub, the brand new sub. Welcome to the Cloud Team. Enjoy your chat badge and your emotes. Come on, server. 
you're sad. That's sad about the rainfall map, yeah. Bbear0313 cheered Dex500. First just chatting stream I'm a part of. This bear, I've never done a just chat. Wait, are we actually in just chatting right now? I mean, we're kind of, we're kind of in, we're kind of just chatting. We're kind of. are. Thanks for the bits. There's Hello. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Server's back up. Yeah, Chuck, go ahead. Go ahead, Chuck. Sorry. You're good. Uh, guys, Bear, thanks for triggering a hype train. Didn't even see mm -hmm. that was a thing. All right, let's hit that button. All right, we're back, chat. We're back, allegedly. Hopefully, we don't do that again. I know, first time. I just, these local woo meteorologists, woo. they just. Chuck -a -chuck -a -chuck. Woo -woo. Throw a police chase video in the corner. All right, first time. Oh, oh. All right, back to my tratter. Welcome to synchronizing data simulator chat. Wrong button. I turned off mention. Whoopsie. That's a happy emote. I like that one. Medosa. <clears throat> we still like it? Welcome to Shader Recovery. Yeah, pretty much. It's still doing it, but it's better. It's better. Give it a minute Definitely after everybody better. gets synced in, hopefully. Attaboy, Tony. Attaboy, Tony. Ghost, thanks for the bits. Appreciate them. Blame Tony. Yep. There you go. What? That's that's me. What what <laughs> what did I do this time? Uh. Uh. So. Without power for thirty hours. Dang. We uh. There was no damage in my neighborhood like at all. There was one little tree thing, a little bush at the end of the street that was like kind of split in half, but but that was about it. There was basically no damage here. But yeah. Oops. Hi, Chuck. I'll turn around. We did kind of crash the server, Ghost. We're really good at that here at Puma Plus. See how it's kind of just like I don't I don't want to call it. What do you call this? It's not rubber banding. Kind of is though, right? I don't, I don't know what you call this. Yeah, skipping, S st stuttering, stuttering. That's it. That's that's a really. Good but word see how it. it's kind of stuttering at times. Like that's not the stream. That is, that is the server. So, 